Here today, Ride U Sports Podcast with Coach Lose and Coach Carl. We're here with the Brooklyn Renegades 11 Hold on, hold on. The undefeated 11 U Renegades. The undefeated Brooklyn Renegades 11 U. Clap it up for yourselves, gentlemen. And the reason why these young men are up here today on the podium is because they had a great contribution to today's win. Number two, I want to start with you. Tell the people what's your name. My name is Juju. I'm number two, and I'm starting running back. Now, you're starting running back. You had to do a lot of dirty work today. Can you take us through what that was like for you today? First quarter, I was nervous because we was going against another undefeated team. The first, the second play, actually, I got hurt. And then I went on the sideline and I was back in the game. So, what was going through your mind as you got hurt? I was just trying to breathe slow because I got the wind knocked out of me. Okay. So, after you got up and you got, you got out the game, you came back in the game and you was hurt. You weren't nervous anymore. Nah. I can tell by the way you were running. You were running like a bat out of hell. You had some great runs. You did all the dirty work for them. You did a great job today. What can we expect moving forward in the postseason? Because you know you're going to play them again. Well, which I can expect from me is more touchdowns, hard hitting, and picks on defense. Your job. You heard it yourself from Mr. Juju himself, Ashy Knee Boy. <laughs> Listen, man, we out here with the Brooklyn Renegades 11 You, We got more people to get to. Coach Lowe, who we got over there? Man, we got, who are we with right now? This it, is the defense. You saw my offense. We want to talk about the guy on defense. Introduce yourself, tell your name and your position. My name is Aiden, a.k.a. Um, Big Twin. Let's do it, Big Twin, a.k.a. Big Twin. You heard? Biggie! Go ahead, come on. Um, I'm a def de defensive end on the um, left side. On the left side? You look like you was playing the right side, the left side, the and the middle. Side, the back was playing side. Both. You was playing both? So, tell, let's, let's talk about your game. What, what what was you thinking when you was when you was playing today? Just um help my team win this and um let's be seven and no be undefeated. Let's be undefeated. Yo, y'all was on the field for a, a major part of the game. Y'all played a lot. The defense was on the field for maybe about three, maybe maybe like three quarters um of the game. How did like let's talk about how you was feeling? Was you tired? Because you was running, you was chasing people down, and I seen you chasing running backs out of bounds. Talk about it. I felt like tired because I, <laughs> I I was carrying the team almost. Okay. All right. But that's what happened, right? Big plays, big players, they step up at that time. All right. So let's say, shout out to Big Twin, man. Shout out to Big Twin. The defense right here, we went in games. Mm -hmm. Hey. That was a great job, young man. Moving along. Going to the small guy, the one they underestimate. Number one, for the people that seen you many times already, tell me your name one more time, number one. My name is Speedy. Listen, Speedy, you had an amazing day today. You iced the game with that juke to get the first down. Walk us through that. How was that for you? So I already knew my coach was calling. I already knew I had the best blockers. So I just had to follow my blocks and get in the hole. So you knew that you had the best blockers. Your brothers had your back. So they did their job. Yeah. What was going through your mind when you put that move on them? You hit them with the dead leg. Oh my God, gotta go. How did that feel for you? I already knew I was gonna get past him because he can't he can't I'm hold not me. Gonna lie. I thought you was gonna score. I was about to say he gotta he gotta do it, he gotta do it. I thought you was gonna score. But you just you know you just wanted to be conservative and get the first down like your coaches told you. You did the right thing, you stayed in bounds. Congratulations on today's game. Listen, you're one of the best athletes on 11 U in the Tri-State area. It's an honor watching you every week go out here Thank and do you. your thing. Tell the people your name again, because they're going to remember this. My name is Speedy. That thing he goes, happy your head, Speedy. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but let's talk about the player that got it all started, because without him, we wouldn't be talking about Speedy. We wouldn't be talking about the running back. Talk about number five and four. All right, give him the mic. Go ahead, Lois, get him. My name's Swag. Swag. He didn't even ask you a question yet. Yeah. Oh, you, 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 you tell him? He, he, he didn't even ask you a question yet. He already. Yet. He already. <laughs> Introduce yourself, man. Uh, my name is Nathaniel Gale. Swag. And yeah. What position you play? I play corner and back and running back. Okay. Corner and back. Up. So, um, the play that I was just talking about, you know what I'm talking about? The play I'm talking about? Yeah, the boomstick. The, oh, the oh he called it the oh, boomstick. Okay. Can, you run, can you run down that play from the beginning for me and, and let, for everybody else to understand what happened there if they wasn't there to see that? Like, like I saw my teammate Six take the outside, so like, so I saw a big hole. So then I just came down. 
Just put the mic down. Say it again, because you said boomstick, now you whispering. So, like, when my teammate six, like, when he took the outside, there was a big hole. Then, so, so there was a big hole, so I just came down and hit him. Okay. Okay. That was just it? You you ain't you ain't think nothing else of it? The ball came out? You ain't think nothing that was just it? Yep. Yeah, that's it. Oh, it's just a, it's just a regular day? Yeah. That's what that's that's what you do on a regular? Yep, it's a okay. walk in the park. Oh, uh, it's a walk in the park? Yes, walk in the park. Okay. Why is it okay. walk in the park? Tell me why is it walk in the park? Cause Tell I do this. Why is it walk in the park? Cause I do this for a living. You do this for a living? Yeah, that's it. Oh, they need to start, they need to start giving you NILs. Yes, they do. <laughs> yo, yo, listen. Hold on, let's talk to those people out there. NILs right now for you football. We got it right here. This is the first signing. Listen, if I had a couple of dollars, I would give it to him right now because uh, that play was um that was, was one of, that, was game game. Yes, that was a game changer. That was a game changer. It was a game changer. Definitely yeah. was a boomstick. Yeah, the on us. The rest left on zero. Yeah. Oh, I see that. so this and was also, the first time they scored. Did anybody ever scored on y'all? Yeah, right. once. How did that once, feel? That was it. How did that feel to know y'all got scored on today? I mean, like. I mean, they were undefeated, so. So I'm defeated teams, it was a tough match. I had right. to fight back. All right. You had to fight back. That's good. Are you one of the reasons why this uh this renegade team is it has been under unscored on? Kind of. Kind of? Cause how many tackles you how many how many tackles I want to count I know I, how many tackles he No, had. I might have I to count no I might have to count the tackles that he didn't get because he got all the rest of them. Yeah, I, I know how many he had. He had, he had about 15 solo easy. tackles. Easy. Solo. 15. Solos. And not, not easy. Not no, easy. He was hawking. He was hawking. He was he like, was I'm going to get you. That's a fact. <laughs> That's a fact. Um, do you pride yourself on getting tackles? Like, is that something that you do? Like, you fight, you chase. Because he chased down a lot of plays, like, back end. On this level, it's difficult. These are people, like, on higher levels that don't do that. Yes. Like, yes. Is that something that your coaches coach? Like, like Play the whistle to whistle, or yeah, stay outside. Stay outside, yes. Definitely you did a great. You, you were the defensive no, you end of the year. That's what we talking about you. You actually stayed outside shoulder. Congratulations. Set in the Thank edge. You. Set in the Seriously. edge. Set in the edge. But we gotta unfortunately get to the captain, the man himself. Yes, sir. Boy, you haven't had your hair done since I met you. <laughs> now let me say something. Moving along. Tell the people out there what's your name. My name is Mason Dean. Mason, I just want to tell you guys something about Mason. This is Mason's, what, first year playing quarterback? Second. Second year playing quarterback. And I just want to say, you can see the progress. You can see the patience. You can see the hard work put in with his quarterbacks. He has one of the best fakes in 11U football right now in the Tri-State. Because you guys ran a play to ice the game. You stayed in bounds. No, you stepped out of bounds, excuse me. You stepped out of bounds, but you could have scored. You got the ball. You faked. I went this way with the camera. Then we went back that way and said, no, he got the voice going that way. Take me through what it's like perfecting your craft. Talking to Mike. It's really, not, it's like, it's like all heart, you know? It's all heart? It, it got to be all heart because every time you run the ball, you're trying to put your helmet in somebody's stomach. Quarterbacks normally don't do that. They slide. They run out of bounds. They get in the pal. They do this. Why are you trying to viciously hit people? Because I like contact. Oh, you like contact. So that means you got a hard head. Oh, all right, all right. That's why they don't get your head done. <laughs> Let's, go back to that. Let's go back to that touchdown. When the quarterback pulled it from the running back and, and tricked everybody, offense, defense, the cameraman, all the coaches. Yeah, what was you guys thinking about at that moment when he scored down there? No, I'm talking about when the Wolfpack scored. Because he faked everybody. Y'all had to get back? Extra point was important? Yeah. So, when y'all guys stopped the extra point, what did you feel after that? After they scored, after they scored our coaches got mad, to the sloppy right now and get the stop. So, being a quarterback, knowing that the pressure's on you, if it's a fumble snap, if anything's go wrong, what were you thinking about back there after that and them final moments of the game? I was thinking about we might lose this because you, cause you never know they might get that extra point. They, you won't lose if you do your job, and you did just that. You did your job, he did his job, he did his job, he did his job, he did his job, and they did their job. 
So therefore, you guys came out victorious. You guys are seven and zero, oh, seven and zero, oh. <coughs> bottom count, seven and zero. Oh. And I just want to say that I'm very, very, very proud of you guys. Keep going. Postseason's coming up. You got more work to do. I know your coach is gonna lock in with you. Make sure that you do your homework. We need nobody not doing their homework. Yes, you have to play. Anything I want to say to the people out there? Hold on, hold on. Get a mic to Speedy. We wouldn't have won or been undefeated if it wasn't for our O line, our D line, our whole team because it's like we're family, so it's it's on the daily we do that. Okay, that's love. He's shouting out the O line and the D line. Where the O line and the D line at? Get in here. Get in here. Yeah. Get in here. Get in here. O line and D line, man. This the O line and D line. Damn, y'all got depth. Y'all seven and zero. This is a big moment. Parents, team moms, everybody, get in here. Team mom, get in here. Everybody, get in here. This is a big moment, and I am so proud of her. Get in the front. You're small. This is a big. <laughs> this is a big. Hey, 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 hey! You, you, head coach, get in here. You, defensive coach, get in here. You. Disciplinarian, get in here, and you, Mr. Kanasi, get your ass over here. <laughs> this is the seven and O Renegades with the Riot U Sports Podcast. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a pleasure, Brooklyn Renegades. Riot U Sports Podcast. We here signing out, Coach Carl, Coach Los. You already know what it is. Rook, I see you.